This is a quick video tutorial to help you toggle your speakers between a laptop and an active board. In order to toggle my speakers, I would go to the start menu, I'd go to the control panel, and then I'm going to click hardware and sound. And on sound, what I want to do is I want to manage audio devices. Now my Promethean speakers are plugged in through the USB port on the side of my computer, and that's these speakers here. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to give them a test. I should hear that sound from my Promethean speakers. I also have speakers that are from my laptop. I'm going to test these as well. Now I have the ability to set either as the default or active device, and there's a couple reasons a teacher might want to do this. If I'm instructing a class and I have a video I want to play on my projector and my active board, I definitely want my speakers to be the default for the USB Promethean. So you see this check mark right here? That means those are currently my speakers, and those are the ones that are going to play the sound that should be activated through the computer. However, if I'm in my plan period, and my active board's at the front of the room, and I'm at the back, but I want to watch a video at my desk, then I can go in here, and I can set as the default device my speakers for my laptop. Now the sound would come from my laptop. So I could test that again, make sure it's working. If I did that, though, I would want to toggle it back so the next time that I worked with my class, right now the check mark is on the laptop, but when I worked with my class, I'd want the check mark to be on the USB speakers. So I'm going to set that as my default device, and then I would be good to go to instruct my class with a video or some type of audio that would come through my Promethean speakers. Now, sometimes your Promethean light will be green, your flame will be blue, and you think your speakers should work, this is probably the setting that's stopping it from working is that it's not currently your default device. But this is a real easy fix. I'm going to show you one more time how to toggle your speakers. I would go to the start menu, open up the control panel, go to hardware and sound, and then I would manage my audio devices, and I would make sure the device I want is both the default, so it would have the green arrow, and then I'd go ahead and give it a test. It works, you should be good, but make sure you have it set to the correct default.